Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvanian toy collector himself, and it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today, we'll be reviewing a figure from a line I've never picked up, but this is a $10 figure line, and this is Transformers. Mars Converters, Glory Dragon, but before we look at the figure itself, we're going to look at the packaging, got some product shots of Glory Dragon in his Dragon Mode and his Bot Mode, and this is a pretty cool figure for a $10 secondary company figure, get the name of the figure and the toy line. Some nice product shots, which is nice. And you're probably wondering, what is Mars Converters? Well, this is a toy line I heard about from my fellow re a reviewer I know in the good old UK. I watch his videos quite a bit. His name is Fuse, Feud of Awesome Transformers. If you haven't heard of him, check out his videos. Well, now we're going to look at the figure itself. Here we got Glory Dragon in his dragon mode, which is pretty cool. I'm sure the head doesn't stay up very well. It's a secondary company knockoff. You get some movement out of the legs, which is nice. Really nice that they put that option in, huh? But now for comparison. Here he is next to another dragon bot I own, and this is the Legends Transformers Prime Predaking. That's all there is to say for that. Wings can move up and down, which is nice with this figure. Tail doesn't move at all. But that's all there is to say for the dragon mode. Let's get down to transformation. Unplug the tail like so, and that becomes the sword. Flip up the back, flip the head up, straighten out the legs, flip down the dragon claw paws to form his arms, flip out the hands, fold down the dragon head, flip out his other hand. And here we got Glory Dragon in his robot mode. And this is a good looking figure for a Predacon inspired figure. But now for comparison. Here he is next to another. He's like leader class. So here he is next to leader class. Transformers Prime Optimus. He is in scale with my leader class prime. Now we're going to give him his sword and get on to the last comparison with Legends Predaking in his robot mode. But he is easily leader class style figure. Oh. Oh. So yeah, he is easily a leader figure given how much I paid for this figure. And here he is next to Predaking in his robot mode. And he is bigger than Legends Predaking. Does a Transformers Mars Converter Glory Dragon belong in a Transformers collection? Yes, he is a good looking figure, a beefy looking figure. And his posability is very good for a figure for a secondary company. He's got some good posability and movement. There's just so much to love about this figure. 
I'd say make an awesome figure to add to your official Predacon shelf. Maximal and Predacon shelf. Well, that's all there is to say for this review. If you like this video, please make sure to like, please make sure to subscribe, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. Thank you, and this is Eddie Hill. Moving on, and rock on, and rock out, YouTube land.